50 para badminton players will represent Uganda at the International Para Badminton starting next week in Lugogo. The team started preparation for the event in July this year. If we were supposed to be taking the team to anywhere in Africa, we would be looking at uh, millions of money for us to even afford to take a team of 10, 5 athletes. But right now, we are at home. We don't have to worry about air tickets or so many other uh, costs that we'll be looking at. So Over 150 players living with physical disabilities from 19 countries will also take part in the competition with the aim of garnering qualification points for world championships among other competitions. Obviously, when, when Uganda as a country is hosting a big tournament like this one here, where are you seeing that we're, we're bringing in a, a big number of countries? Uh, there are several advantages. First of all, to our athletes, the exposure they're going to get, uh, and then the learning experience they're going to get from uh, these top athletes, like India, which is performing very well right now in, in para badminton. After the Uganda International Competition, African countries will go on to compete in the Africa Badminton Championships, still in Lugogo. We are having two tournaments, but first of all, we are going to have the the international Uganda International Para Badminton Championships. That uh, that the tournament is going to start on Monday, uh, the 12th, and it will run through to the 18th. And then immediately after that, on the 19th, we shall have the, the one that is uh, for Africa. The Uganda Badminton Association has received a 5 million shilling check from the Bank of Baroda to help in the preparations. Regina Naluja, NTV Sport.